few minutes ago, at your point, told her I noticed a view went from 10 down to 5, and she gave me some reasons why that's happening. What, what's your take on that? Um, and and what is your, how, she said your role has evolved, and if it has, what, how has it, and how you feel about that? Uh, well, you know, it's my senior year, and it's been disappointing. Five, you know, as you mentioned earlier. But I'm not really uh, about scoring, mm -hmm. but just my play in general has been down. So uh, I just made it. So this game, I'm, I'm trying to step it up the next couple of games. Mm -hmm. So um, I think my team, they look towards me because I'm saying. So it's important for me to pick it up. And I noticed it as well. So um, hopefully this is a good start, you know. That has some tough losses. Was it hard? Yes, it's Getting, the closest. Behind, I was looking at the record. I mean, they like, <laughs> it's a really, like, really close game. Our record doesn't define. So you took you know, that on the shoulder? Yes. Our, you said you've been down, like, being a senior? Yes, our coaches, you know, they encourage us every day. Our record definitely do, does not define who we are as a team. You know, we lost a couple of close games, too. And we pulled one out today. <laughs> so that shows the improvement and the trust we have in each other. So that's important for us. And hopefully, you know, we're on a two-game winning streak, so watch out for us. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, it's going to be conference be starting. Yeah. Well, Coach, you know, you obviously been scoring better lately. You know, you started out, you did the turnovers. What, mm -hmm. what have you done mentally to kind of correct that situation? I mean, I, I've been thinking about it a lot more because in practice I had a whole lot, so I've been thinking about it. Uh, Coach Emily actually talked to me after one practice and – I've just been working on it, I guess. I call it young one. <laughs> <laughs> you seem real confident out there now. You, you feeling pretty good about this? You, yeah. you should be letting the point guard, big sister, take, take yeah, on Yeah, I got a, you know, a little dog here, so. <laughs> yeah, What's going on with the scoring? You just seeing the court better, or are you playing within the offense? What's happening out there? I mean, yeah, the offense, I just, Calm down and let the offense come to me now. I I forced a couple of shots th throughout the game, but um, I just slowed down and started letting the game come to me. So they talk talk about uh, you know your scoring today. I mean, obviously you were playing a, another Detroit uh, guard in Tavlin James, and you guys did um, a great job in holding her down. But when you see an offensive player like that. Um, you know, did that make you want to go out there and really, you know, put some points on the board? Or you got to play in your offense. You just still got to play in the offense and play the game. I mean, you didn't know Mr. James was out there before <laughs> yeah. the game. You knew she was a big I knew scorer. she was gonna be a big scorer in the game, but uh, we had Jaleesa on her, and Jaleesa yeah. is a good de defensive player, so. Put the locks on. She's like second in the nation. Yeah, Coach, can you talk about uh, the play of today's team? I mean, you guys really held Tavlin James. I mean, if I would, you know, we talked yesterday and uh, and how about you just can only hope to contain her. But holding her to about nine, ten points, that's more than containing her. <laughs> well, I, I like I said, um, I just gave all the credit to Jaleesa. She really just stuck on her. And for her having to, to just get around every triple screen, double screen, hip checks. I mean, she was bounced all over the place. And, you know, when, when she was able to shake free, like I said earlier, uh, it was in transition and, and Jaleesa wasn't on her, to be honest. She might have got switched off somewhere. Uh, but when she was face to face, nose to nose with her, she, she was not comfortable. And, uh, you know, our, our post kids did a great job of, you know, if Jaleesa, Jaleesa was a step behind, they maybe hedged out for a second until she got back. And, uh, I mean, it was picture perfect what she was able to do and then she had to turn around and, and be the general on the offensive end as well so I, I just you probably need a nap or something <laughs> um, you better get to bed early so I would imagine that both mentally and physically um, she's got to be exhausted but for her to step up as a senior take out 25 points a game really uh, cause all kind of havoc and and then to turn around and score, I mean, is that a career high? Is it 19? Kind of? No, I got it's a it. season high. A season, season high. high, okay, yeah. season high. Uh, just incredible. And obviously we should have had her shooting free throws at the end, but <laughs> maybe we shouldn't, we shouldn't have had to play the extra five minutes. But, yeah, it was, it was a great effort. 
at least to talk about hitting, the, you know, going to the line late in the game there. You know, we saw a great player in Sharita Brown, a freshman, a young player, step up to the line and, and, you know, was not able to hit those shots. But you as a senior, I mean, is that is that the role you want to take? Is that the role you have to take as a senior oh, in yeah. those situations? Yeah, of course. You know, we have uh, confidence in all our players. We, you know, line up and practice. We practice free throw. So if anyone steps to the line, you know, we encourage them to make it. But, of course, you know, this is my last year and I uh, – I really don't feel pressure because, you know, I just think my teammates have my back and I just know it's like a regular any other two free throws. So, um, when she, I know she was down about missing the two free throws, but uh, she looked to us and she knew we had we had her back. So, we wasn't down about it. We just had to play five more minutes and we was ready for it.